The drawing cleanup command, or otherwise known as the map clean command, performs cleanup operations on data to improve the accuracy of your drawing file. This tool aids in correcting common geometry errors resulting from surveying, digitizing, scanning errors, or just user input. It removes unnecessary detail from complex maps. This is essential when you need accurate and complete drawings. But in general, you can only clean up linear objects such as lines, arcs, circles, and polylines. In this drawing example, you can see that we have objects that are laying on top of one another, objects that are broken, we have objects that overshoot one another, and objects where apparent intersections should occur. We also want to take some of these objects and combine them and turn them to one single entity, perhaps a polyline. Notice down here on the left hand side we also have broken up lines. We'd like to combine those together and form a single line. So to get to the drawing cleanup or map clean dialog box, on the F dot ribbon under quality control select drawing cleanup. A dialog box launches with a wizard that will guide you through the steps of operation. The steps are listed on the left hand side of the dialog box. The first step is to select the objects that you want to clean. On top you have objects to include in your drawing cleanup. You can either select all the objects in the drawing or you can manually select the objects. Here I'm going to select the objects and left click on the screen and window the objects that we want to clean up. Click next. Here you have your cleanup actions. This is where you specify what cleanup actions you want to perform on the drawing file. On the left hand side you have your cleanup actions. On the right hand side you have the actions that you're applying to the drawing. Simply select the action, click add to add it to the right hand side of the dialog box. Notice as you select the actions you can specify different tolerances for each action. For more detailed explanation of the cleanup actions, refer to the help documentation included in with this wizard. On the bottom left hand side we have two options. We have the option to let AutoCAD automatically clean the objects or we have the option to interactively clean each option at a time. Notice as I specify automatic or interactive, the option becomes available for us on the left hand side. But here we're just going to do automatic and let Civil 3D do the work for us. Click next to go to the next step. Here we have our cleanup menu. This is where you specify how you want to treat the objects that are being cleaned. We can modify the original objects, we can tame the original objects and create new objects, or we can delete the original objects, create new objects, and specify the layer that we want the new objects to create on. Here we're just going to modify the original objects. Also we have the option to convert objects as they're being modified. Here we want to change our lines to polylines. If we have arcs, still change to polylines. If we have circles, we can change those to polylines as well. When you're through with specifying your cleanup actions, click Finish. Now you can see in our file that our line work looks a lot more cleaner. If I bring my cursor over the line work, you can also see that we now have lines that have been com converted to polylines, and we no longer have broken up lines. You can see that we no longer have overshoots, and you can see that our intersections have now been cleaned up as well.